What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys the main story finale for my playthrough on new Pokemon Snap for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode, we completed Blushing Beach Level 2, our last Lumino spot in the Derice area, and we unlocked the Ruins of Remembrance. And in today's video, we're going to be completing the main story by finding the final Illumina Pokemon. So if you guys are hype, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support that's been going out across this channel. But like I said, we unlocked the final spot, which is the Ruins of Remembrance, and we are going to be finishing up the main story in today's video. But it's not going to be the last Pokemon Snap video, considering I want to go back to every single place, unlock level 3 for every place, and complete the photo decks and take a picture of every single Pokemon in the game. But we're going to get started here. By going here, we still have to unlock the Illumina Orbs and then trigger the final story cutscene and unlock the final Illumina Pokemon. I know what the final Illumina Pokemon is, but I know you guys don't. It's actually very, very cool. I actually saw a little bit of spoilers. This was a while back, but I'm glad I did, but then I'm glad I did it at the same time. But now I know what to expect, but so this game has been amazing. But that leads me to question of the day, and that is what are your all-around thoughts on this game? Do you guys like it? Did you guys actually pick it up or did you just watch the playthrough? Because my final thoughts is I think this game is actually amazing. A lot of replay value with it, a lot of time you can use onto it. Oh, there's a nice little crystal moon. Just all around, I think it was a solid game. I would really rank it like as a solo player game, probably like a seven plus out of ten, maybe more. Depends. It really does depend. There is a lot of replay value, which is absolutely amazing with this game, and the graphics are phenomenal. I just think all around, it's a great step in the Pokemon or in the direction that uh, Pokemon should be taken. But in order to unlock the Lumina Orbs, we actually had to find Woobat, a Lumina Woobat, and he actually comes out of a well that will be down to the left here. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do that. We can actually get that and get rolling with it. Yeah, we got my boy Houndoom. I love Houndoom. I think he's so cool. And the reason I didn't find Woobat last time was because I was distracted by this uh this Noiburn that should be popping out here. Yeah, there he is. My boy Noiburn. What's goody? Let me play him a song. Can I do a scan here too? Oh, yo, what? That is dope. Can I hit you with an apple? I smoke you with an apple? Oh, really? Oh, dude, this is dope. Let me scan you again. Do something cool. He's so sick. Noivern is a top tip Pokemon. I absolutely love this guy. I actually got distracted by the sandal that's over here. But if you come over here, there is a well right here. And if you actually start throwing fluff fruit and get one down there, Woobat is going to pop out here and start snapping pictures of him. Try to get a good one of him that you can hand in. Woobat is cool. And then once you do that, there you go. All you got to do is hand it into the professor and bingo, you are done. You get yourself some Lumina Orbs for this place, which I believe that's how it works. And I believe we can actually just leave and quit research if we really want to. I might do. I might actually take a few pictures of other Pokemon so I can guarantee level 2 here because I was really close to getting it. But I think that's going to be the plan. I think we're going to get a few pictures of other Pokemon and we're going to roll off from there. But if you actually see all these little, uh, these glowing stones, there's there's Crystal Blooms next to them all. So once we actually unlock Crystal Blooms in order to trigger the final Illumina spot, we actually had to light up every single Crystal Bloom in the room to light up this Ruin of Remember. So, pretty cool. It's pretty dope. All around, I think this place is phenomenal. I think it's a good final spot for this game. My boy Golurk, it's goody. Can I actually toss this at you? <laughs> I like the noise it makes when you smoke someone with a fall fruit. Hey, yo, Sigleth, what's good? Hey, let me get a better picture of you. That's actually pretty dope pictures of Sigleth. Golurk, I need a better picture of you. Let me scan you up. So we got going on here. Nice little lovely scan. And I will keep rocking out and we'll go around this way. Oh, Bohemian. Bohemian. His name always like weirds me out. Oh, that is a solid picture of Bohemian. Scan. Get another picture of my I have 26 left. I'm trying to use them up, get good pictures of every Pokemon. Like I said, oh my lord, yo, that, <laughs> that kind of scared me. I'm trying to get good pictures of every single Pokemon just so we can uh, get a lot of XP here. Level up this place. Oh, yo, my boy Golar. If I, I need, uh, that's not a good picture. Sometimes you zoom in and you get too much zoom in. You really do. Yo, let's get my boy Houndoom here. Not bad. Where's my boy Natu? Goody. That's not a bad picture. That's not a bad picture at all. Maybe I'm flying. I don't really need a better picture of him. I already got a good one of him. Elder Gosses. Can I throw apples at him? Scan him, maybe. Poke him in the head. I can actually scan here. And uh, what do we got over here? What's that? Oh, it's tracks. N deep gashes. In the remembrance or in the ruins. Uh, let's get a picture of... Is there any other Pokemon I can get? There's Golurk. I think we're good here. I really do think we're good. I'm actually just going to quit research. Go back to the professor, show him the pictures, and uh, get level 2, and hopefully unlock the Lumina Orbs. We should be able to, because that is the only, like, uh, objective to do, is to get a picture of that Woobat. So, it should trigger unlocking the Lumina. We get some cool pictures of, uh, 
my boy Houndoom, but I'm gonna take this one. Ugly Goss, we only have one star picture, so I'm looking for the one with the most points. Nat 2, didn't hand in a one star one. We got some good ones of Bohemian. I think this one's the best one, him floating in the air. Noivern, we got some three star ones of him as well. I'm looking for like the most up close one. We do have a diamond one star, so we should pick a three star one. I think this one's our best one. Him with the, uh, his wings wide open. Woobat, we gotta pick our best one for this one, see how many points we can get. We got any other pictures of him? Glow in here. He doesn't look like he's glowing there, right? I think best picture is going to be like it's gonna be like this one. Let's hand in that one. Hopefully that does the trick. We get a picture of the crystal bloom as well, but cannot hand it in. Get a Siglith up in here. This is go. This is Golar. <laughs> I like this picture <laughs> just because we got Siglith, but so oh no, we have a diamond one already. Let's just hand in a two star one. Two star. That's the only two star one we have. All right, so looks like it's that one. We only have one two stars with Sigleth in there. And we got a new one for Sigleth. We got one star one. I would love to hand in. What's our best one? That one's good. This one's our best one. Right here. Hand that one in. And can I select an ancient ruin picture? Sure. All right. Let's hand them in. See what we get. But guys, you realize I'm wearing a new hat. My sponsorship actually sent me this one into the AM. I love this beanie so much. If you guys want to pick one up yourself, link is down in the description below. Use that link down there to get 10% off. It'll benefit me, benefit you. They got awesome quality products. If you haven't checked out their website yet, definitely go check it out. I'm telling you guys, I wear their product all the time. I'm going to a party tomorrow night, which will be Saturday by the time this video uploads. And I already have my outfit planned out. And I'm using one of their basic tees. Their basic tees rock. They're comfy and they look good as well. All around, their quality of the product is amazing. And I highly recommend picking them up because they have solid prices all around for the quality of their products but we're gonna roll out here and in our photos natu did not get diamond get out of my face him yeah, yeah, i knew that one would get diamond solid photo right there noivern no diamond out my face woo back this is the one we're looking for this is the one we need hope it's good enough photo hopefully we got it show it to me all we need him to do is say oh by the way then we know we're chilling let's see you my aluminum orb See what he says come on hey by the way and we are gonna get level two which means next time we head in there we're gonna get some new pokemon here as well but my main focus is going to be um my main focus is going to be uh getting the luminal orbs let's see there's the by the way beautiful now we got the crystal bloom info blah 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 blah, blah. we get some new requests we can head back to camp get our luminal orbs and head back and trigger the final story or the final cutscene for the uh final luminous spot for this game yeah, awesome. We get level two, so there's gonna be some new Pokemon. I know Chandelure's in this place, which is amazing. He's one of my favorite Pokemons. I don't know why. He's just such a cool Pokemon. I feel like you can't just have like ten favorite Pokemon. You have to have like twenty-five of them. There's just so many Pokemon nowadays that you just need a whole group of Pokemon that are your favorite. But we trigger this little cutscene right here. He talks about the blah blah blah, the ruins, blah blah blah. I already know what to do. And he's gonna hand us this Illumina Orb. We get a golden Illumina Orb so we can light up any Crystal Bloom with it. And we can rock out with it. So we're heading straight back there. We get ourselves a nice little sticker with the gold Illumina Orb. And we're gonna head back to that research lab and uh, go back to the Ruins of Remembrance. And we get it level two. Beautiful. 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 So we are going to have some new Pokemon here as well. I'm going to try to get as many Pokemon as I can, but my main focus, like I said, is going to be letting up these Crystal Blooms, but there are a lot of them, so I got to make sure I hit every single one of them to trigger the final cutscene, because if we miss even one of them, then we don't get anything. Then we have to play this thing all over again and restart. I think we should be fine. Come here. Let me throw some Illuminate Worms at you. Yo, you look dope. You look so dope. Elder Gloss. Oh, more Elder Glosses. There's so many more. Yo, we sniped that one. Let me light these Crystal Blooms. Oh yeah, look at these boys. Look at these boys. Look at these boys. There's so many more extra Elder Gloss right here. Hit you. Want an apple? Eat up. It's not a bad photo. Not a bad photo. But we don't have to start lighting up Crystal Blooms until we get down into the ruins. That one right there, you don't even have to light up. It's just there to be there. Anything over here? Ancient Ruins. This thing's enormous. This is enormous. Imagine like seeing this place in real life. It'd be amazing. But we're heading down into the hole. Do 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 do. Houndoom. Snipe. <laughs> I love just hitting Pokemon with the uh, Lumina Orbs. Look at here. Oh, there's a, sa a Salandit. A salad, we'll call him. We'll just call him Salads. <laughs> I feel like that name fits him so much better. There's my boy Noibat. Or Noivern. Come here, let me hit you with this Lumina Orb. Oh! Yo, what a photo. What a photo. That's got to be his four star photo, right? Smoky with Lumina Orbs. 
That's gotta be his four star photo. You see that thing? He was going nutty. He's going nutty. But let's see if we can uh we'll do bad or the second stage come out here? Nope, it's just woo bad again. I thought the second stage would come out here. I thought that would be hilarious. Get another picture of him. And now we oh my god, yo, what are you doing? <laughs> Turn around, this thing's in my face. Like, get him out of here. Are we not moving? Are we not moving? Okay, now we're moving again. Now we're onward. Let me get a better picture of you. Nah, I can't. He's so sick. When he did that thing, that's got to be his four-star pose. He was just, like, shooting his ultrasonic waves out here. We got Sigilus down here. If I can smoke him before we actually head to the ruins. Oh, there we go. Do something crazy. Do something crazy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Who does that? Yo, Shandle. You were so sick, Shandle. Oh, I just smoked Chandelure, but we gotta focus on these Illumina Orbs down here. Chandelure, baby. And there's our first Crystal Boom we got to actually hit. Can I hit that from there? Oh, I smoked that first try. So there we go. Light up the first ruin. Can I start hitting that one? Oh, there's plenty over there. That would have been a snipe. There's one there. We gotta start lighting up this one. I'm gonna start hitting it. So I can make sure I get it. Got it. There we go. There's two. We gotta make sure we can get all five. Let me try to hit you. Come here. Chandelure pop. Chandelure pop. I need a picture of you. Oh, dude. Pokemon's so sick. Uh, what game was it? Pokemon Tournament. Where this Pokemon looks so sick. I used to love using Channel in Pokemon Tournament. I used to play for the Wii U. When I had a Wii U, I wasn't recording. I started recording in like 20... What was it? 2018? I think it was 2018 when I started recording. It's been a great journey. It has been a phenomenal journey. Thank you guys for all the support. I love recording videos for you guys all around. We light up all these places with the Crystal Bloom. Let me hit that one again see if it does anything different. Channel pops showing over there. And now we gotta get this other one. Channel. Can I get a better picture of you? Where you at, girl? Channel. Gotta love it. Is that a crystal bloom? No, it doesn't do anything. But here's the next one. Where's the crystal bloom for here? Oh, Mr. Crystal Bloom. Like hidden? Where are you, Mr. Oh, there it is. Is that it? Yeah, that lights this one up. Okay, cool. So we got three out of the five lit up. I'm doing showing there. Uh, Elder Gloss there. There's another one, so let me sneak sneak it in there. Move! Move! There you go. Move, Elder Glosses. There we go. Get that Crystal Bloom. Light that one up. I need those things to move. They weren't moving. And here's the last one. Now, where is the Crystal Bloom for here? That's the real question. Ooh. Hello. Um, where's the Crystal Bloom for here? Where is this one at? Someone show it to me. Oh, it's behind you. Move. Move out the way. I found it. Golurk, I need you to move. Move. I gotta snipe that. Come on. Move. Yes, move. Move. Golurk, move. What are you doing? Oh, he's moving. He's moving. Are you kidding me? I cannot get that. Oh, I got it. I sniped it. I sniped it. Now I guess I need to light up all these. I think I got to light them all up. I think we got it. I think we got it. Dude, I can't believe I sniped that last second. Yep, this thing's slowing. We got it. Any other Pokemon? Yo, Absol's showing you. Let me get a few pictures of you. Like I said, it's hard to focus on the Pokemon while you're here. Oh, that's a dope picture. It's hard to focus on the Pokemon while you're here considering uh, you have to get so many different Illumina or Glow Crystal Blooms. We got a few pictures of Absol before we end off here. Dude, if I would have missed that, I would have been so upset. Because that Golurk was legit just standing there bothering me. <laughs> I was like, get out of my way, dude. Him yam. Just trying to use up my photos before we actually finish up this uh, little expedition run. This is how you know you did it right. When you start going up to this thing and this thing starts glowing. But beautiful. Got that done. We unlocked the final Illumina spot for this game. Ruins have come to life. Yes, sir. I can't wait for you guys to see the Illumina Pokemon. It's a great choice for a final boss or final Pokemon. Each island seems to be flowing upward. Dude, these cutscenes are awesome. Amazing. They gotta add them into the uh, Legends Arceus game. The Arceus, or I say Arceus. So Some people say go. Arceus. I say Arceus. I'll set up a teleportation point at the top. Why don't you come back to camp for a Teleportation test? point at the top. No problem. I gotta do all your dirty work. All you gotta do is hit a button and set up a teleportation thing. I'm going into caves with huge dragon Pokemon. They can shoot fire at me if they really want to. But, yeah, Pokemon are really nice. They are really nice. But, <laughs> but you guys know what I'm saying. This professor's sitting in his lab and all that. He's like, hey, young boy, go out there with these giant monsters. <laughs> 
But we get nine Pokemon. We take 50 photos. We got some new ones as well, so that's good. I think we got a four star photo of uh I gotta hand in a one star one, so I'm gonna hand in this one. Well we got three star of LD. I'll hand in that one. Wait, is that four? It is a four star photo. Just dope. Which one's our best one? I think it's gonna be this one over that one. To so that, hand in another picture of Wu Bat, just get some XP. Take a look. We already handed in a three star one, but we have a two star one, which is nice. I'll hand in that one. Shandlord, baby. What's my best picture of Shandle? Hmm. I don't really have any good ones with him. I think my best one might be like this one. Him hiding behind the ruin. The ruins. Absol. I really do like this one. I'm gonna hand in that one. The Himium. We got three star one. Never handed in before. And a gold lurk new. Three star one. Can we have not handed in a three star one? I like this one because he has like a little glow to him. So we'll hand in all these photos, see what we get, and then finish off the main story of this game. Oh my god, yo, this playthrough has been so fun. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it. It really does go a long way because I know a lot of you guys uh, do watch the Pokemon content way more. Or not Pokemon, this is Pokemon content, but I know you guys watch Pokemon Sword and Shield content way more. But I have a blast doing the side playthroughs. It keeps me going and it doesn't burn me out of one single game. So I'm glad I was able to play a game I really, really like. I think the next game we're going to either do is Mario Golf or Skyward Sword HD. Because I still like to be a new Nintendo channel, even though Pokemon's my top rated content. Like when Splatoon 3 comes out, we're going to be killing that game. I'm going to try to get live streams back. I've been very busy. I think once my uh, summer job ends, that's when Splatoon 3 will come out. So then I can start banging out some uh, live streams again. Uh, when new Mario Kart comes out, whenever they announce it, I heard leaks about that. When Breath of the Wild 2 comes out, we're going to be crushing that. So, hopefully you guys do stay tuned for all the content that we have to offer. We almost have level 3 for this place, which is awesome. So, that's going to be easy for us to record when it comes out. By the way, thanks for the progress we made. Blah, blah, blah. We did all this stuff. We're going to return to camp, trigger the final cutscene, get rolling with this finale. Get rolling with this finale. If you guys haven't checked out my last Pokemon Sword and Shield video, I do believe we just used the best team in the game right now. At the moment of this recording, I think that is the best team. I dominated with this team. No close battles. We went 3-0 and just won every single battle super easily. Okay. It was awesome. It looks like we got a moment. We got... Uh, we're going to go to the center of the ruins and all that good stuff. The yep. mural. Okay, yeah, I remember that mural. That was probably yep. the best cutscene in the game. We should have did more cutscenes like that all throughout the game. But, okay, we did unlock the final Illumina Pokemon. We're heading back. We get in after. All we got to do is get a picture of this final Pokemon. And then we finish up the game. Do, do, Illumina spot, baby. Illumina spot, y'all. I cannot wait for you guys to see this Pokemon. It looks phenomenal in this game. Like, probably because this game has the best graphics for Pokemon. Hands down. Like, there's no argument. So, when you see this Pokemon in these graphics, it's just going to blow your mind. It is crazy. We head into these ruins. We get a little tree here. Get a little tree. Looks like that's the source of the reading, but it's very faint. Let me hit it with an orb. What is that anyway? Dude, that's a tree. Are you stupid? <laughs> what is that anyway? It's a dang tree. Oh, but uh, I didn't see the cutscene. I just know the Pokemon. Okay, so all these little ruin things come in here? Rainbow. Yes, sir. Light it up. What is this? Oh, that looks so sick. Incredible. Oh, now, now it makes sense. I, I got it. I got it. Yo, look at this Pokemon. It's your boy, Xerneas. Oh, my lord. Look, what did I say? He looks incredible. Look at him. Are you serious? Bro, imagine playing a Pokemon game that with those graphics. The final Illumina Pokemon we've been searching for. Go get him. Incredible. Imagine going up to a legendary, like walking into a cave like this. And seeing that. So here's our final Illumina Pokemon. It's Xerneas. He turns into like this little orb thing and he flew away. So I guess we gotta throw apples or like scan them or throw Illumina Orbs at him. Do we have Illumina Orbs? We do. We do have everything that we need. He's over there. Hello. Hello. Let's see if I can smoke him. I'm gonna throw some Illumina Orbs at him. Usually that's what you gotta do with Illumina Pokemon. Just hit him with Illumina Orb and then they uh they light up, you take a picture of him, and then you're pretty much set. Where'd he go? Where'd my boy go? Play, play him a little tune. There you are. I hit you with an orb. Try to lead him. He's so far out. What, would happen if you hit that glow with an orb? what do you think I'm trying to do, Professor? I can't hit this thing.
I hit it. Oh, I hit it. What's that do? Where are you going? I hit it. What are you doing? Let me hit it again. I hit it multiple times, I'm guessing. You gotta lead this thing like crazy. What are you doing? Where are you going? Did it go that way? I think it went this way. I already hit it. I think you gotta hit it multiple times. It's a pain in the neck to hit. Yeah, I hear it down there somewhere. In the water? Is that in the water? There you are. I don't even know where it's at. Oh, there it is. If I can snipe it. I'm going around the ruins. Oh my God, I can't hit this thing. I cannot hit this thing. I really need to dial it in. Come on, Jeans, you're better than this. I think I just hit it there. I have to hit it straight on in the water because, like, he's, he's getting the dust and everything. Let's scan here. We'll just leave me too. Okay, so, ooh, that's a mural right there. That crystal bloom? We light that up, that crystal bloom. We light up that crystal bloom. Where'd that little thing go? Get a picture of that. That looks dope. Oh, there you are. Hello. Hey, how you doing? Where'd it go? What's this dang thing at? There you are. Come here! Dude, I legit cannot hit this thing for nothing. If we don't get a picture, I'm gonna be upset. Where's Xerneas? There we go. Hit it again, and now it's lighting up like crazy. Can I hit him one more time as he goes in this vest? Nope, there he is. Xerneas, baby! Okay, we got a few pictures of him, which is dope. At least real quick. Oh, there he is again. That is so sick. Where'd he go? He dipped out this way. Okay, so we got a few photos of him, which is awesome. Pain in the neck to hit. I think you gotta hit him like three or four times. This thing's moving real quick. You gotta be a sniper with this thing. Where'd he go? Dude, it looks gorgeous. looks insane. The best is like every time a new Pokemon game comes out, everyone's like, yo, dude, the graphics are amazing. And then you look back on them. Like, give it like, give it a couple years. Give it five, six years. We're going to say Pokemon Sword and Shield's graphics were awful. Or this game's graphics were awful. That's what we're going to be like. We're going to be like, ew, new Pokemon Snap's graphics were doo-doo. When the new games come out, like, dude, it's just crazy how, like, how much better, like, you don't know technology can get. Like, you think it's the best of the best right now, and then give it a couple years, it's ten times better than what it was. Like, it doesn't look like it can, be it can get better than this, but it can. And it's crazy how far, like, technology has really come. But where's my boy Xerneas? Where's that little glowing orb? I haven't seen him in a little bit. We're back at the beginning spot. Just looped all the way back. I think we, I think we're done here. We got our pictures. I think Xerneas just went out on us. Hit him a couple times. Got our pictures. That's all we needed. And there's that orb again. Oh baby, there you are. Oh my lord. This is one of the best looking legendaries I think of all in all of Pokemon. Just on looks wise, like look at that thing. It did such a good job on its design. Rainbow, and it's the first fairy type, fairy legendary. It's incredible looking. Okay, throw a Pokeball at it. No time for pictures. We want that thing on our team. <laughs> I never realized his, his eyes have X's in them for Pokemon X. I never realized that. That's, that's actually a really cool touch. Look at his eyes. Pupils are X's. That's crazy. Yes, sir. Zern, baby. He's using Geomance. That's an awesome move. I love that move. There you go. This giant flash turns back into a tree. So I guess that's what he actually is. <laughs> He's a tree. What just happened? Let's talk about it once you're back. Ooh. What a way to finish off this game. Great Pokemon actually finished it off. And that was our first legendary. I think each place has a legendary. So I guess that one's just a Lumina Spot legendary, blah, blah, blah. But other places you actually have to do like crazy stuff in order to trigger the legendary to come out and snap a quick photo of them. So cannot wait to do that for each place after uh, this video. Because next videos are just going to be maxing out places, catching legendaries, finishing up the photo decks. We only got one picture of this thing. Wow, we only did. Wow, that's actually insane. Thank God we got one picture of him. <laughs> Could you imagine if we didn't get any pictures of him and we had to do it again? There you go. Give me a diamond. I don't think he's gonna be diamond. We don't got space. Actually, we get a little bit of space. Size ain't bad. It's usually not too hard to get diamond for these uh 
a Lumina Spot Pokemon. They wasn't even a good picture, and they're like, here, here's a diamond photo. With my research levels, we do level it up to level two. It's easy light work. I don't think we're going to be leveling up a Luminous Spots to level two or three and all that stuff. But considering I don't think there's any extra Pokemon in there, I just think they do different poses. I think that's just how we do it. We can return to camp, get out of here, and uh, trigger the credits. I think uh, there will just be like one more cutscene and then credits should roll. Odds tips, everybody pose. Pokemon in a photo that aren't subject to the photo still affect your score, so pay attention to how they're posing. Obviously. I do want to see how many Pokemon we have left in our photo decks. I think that'll be our starting thing for the next video. That mural is cool. I would love to get a photo of that. Like a tin poster of it. Because like paper posters are so like out of style now. But like the metal tin ones, you can order like a bunch of them online. They're like metal tin posters. I would love to get a, like, a picture of that. I think it's really dope. So what? Also. Are we done with this cutscene? You know I don't like to read these stuff. <laughs> I just like to click through. Some games I actually do read. If they're like a really good solo player game, like Breath of the Wild 2, I would definitely read and like go into details and all that. But like a game like this, I really do not need to know the detail. Get what? Of course. So obvious. Yo, my boys are here. What's goody? Penelope. Evie. Pikachu. Starly. Oh, yo, Rabombi. That's not Rabombi, is it? It's the first stage. It's uh. Cutie fly. Boy, it's cutie so fly. Do I do like Rabombi too. I think it's an awesome fairy and bug type. Especially for competitive. It's a lot of fun to use. I used to How use it a good bit. Really loves them. Yeah. <laughs> right back. Right? Sure. That's a great picture right there. I forget what that giant dog's called again. I know the first stage is Yamper. Second stage, bro. I forget what that thing's called. Hey, look at that final picture, yo. Starly's holding up. Oh, it's Stoutland. That's the picture. That's the Pokemon. But there it is. That is the end of the main story for Pokemon Snap or new Pokemon Snap here. The staff crabs. Can I skip through this? I can indeed. Yo, look at these pictures. And we jam in here. And we jam in here. I'm not even going to skip it. I'm just going to do my outro here. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be starting post game, completing the photo decks, and catching some legendaries. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.